Fritz Njoki Ndungu, who was one of the two judges who gave a dissenting opinion here, says when electronic components fail, the manual transmission takes place. It is largely a manual process in Kenya's election. And in Kenya, this mongrel is something that needs to be looked at. Uh, it is the one causing the problems. In her view, she felt that uh, recounting the votes would have been a proper way of solving the stalemate in the country. We also had uh, Justice Jack Tonajuang, another one who also gave a dissenting opinion there. And he says, I am of the majority opinion that uh, the majority decision failed to resonate with the Constitution. The case was not valid and was based on weak grounds. So according to Justice Ojuang there, Raila Odinga's team failed to provide uh, enough evidence really to lead to the nullification of an election faulting the decision uh, by the majority bench there. I also have uh, several snippets from what was said by Justices Isaac Lenaola, Deputy Chief Justice Philomena Mwilu, as well as uh, Chief Justice uh, David Maraga. Uh, but of course, uh, one of the most outstanding uh, decisions here, opinions here, was the one by uh, Justice Njoki Ndung, which took quite a long time uh, reading out her dissenting opinion, uh, saying that she felt the majority, uh, the majority bench rather, uh, had uh, nullified the election with regard to technical Technicalities without regarding the rights of the voter as enshrined in the Constitution. So we see pictures there uh, of uh, the judges exchanging a few words uh, during uh, the uh, final verdict or the reading of the full Supreme Court verdict. But uh, 